Hello friends and welcome back to Sunday School Online. Today we're learning about the first church, which wasn't about the building or the place, but about the people. As always, we're going to start with a song and today we're doing He's Got the Whole World in His Hands. He's got the whole world in his hands, he's got the whole world. In his hand, he's got the whole world. In his hand, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the itty bitty babies. In his hand, he's got the itty bitty babies. In his hand, he's got the itty bitty babies. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got you and me, sister. In his hands, he's got you and me, brother. In his hands, he's got you and me, sibling. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got everybody here. In his hands, he's got everybody here. In his hands, he's got everybody here. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world. In his hand, he's got the whole world. In his hand, he's got the whole world. In his hand, he's got the whole world in his hands. Before our story, we are going to say the Lord's Prayer. And if you're wondering what I'm doing with my hands, I'm doing the American Sign Language. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory now and forever amen and now for our story the first church. The new believers studied with the disciples. They learned many things about God and God's plans. They prayed together. They sang songs and praised God. They ate meals and celebrated the Lord's Supper together. They shared everything they had with each other. God added more and more believers to the church every day. So in our story, they didn't say they built the building with bricks. They said they spent time together and the people learned together, learned from each other. They sang songs together. They talked to each other. So even though right now we can't actually go to church, we can still spend time together just like they did in the first church. I'm going to pray and then I will show you one final animal. Dear Lord, thank you for allowing us to be together as a church, even if we can't be together in person. And as always, please give us the strength to do the right thing, even when it's hard. In your name we pray. Amen. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I was going to show you guys the hermit crab today, but uh, hermit crabs tend to bury themselves under the sand which he is currently doing, so we can't see him. But I will show you something kind of cool. We used to have a lot of hermit crabs, and now we just have one. But when they grow bigger, they go underground and they let their kind of exoskeleton come off, and then they need to find a bigger shell. So you have to let them have lots of shells around so that when they grow, they can fit into a bigger shell. And some of them are pretty and painted, like this one with the bee, and some of them are just how they were on the beach, like these ones over here. 
that's it for today. Um, remember, I have my story time videos up there in a playlist, which I will try and link over here. Uh, there's two videos so far. Hopefully, hopefully there'll be more up this week. I just got a bunch of new books, so I'm really excited. So go and check those out. Uh, and if you want to get an alert every time I post a new video, uh, hit the subscribe button and you'll see all of them right when they come out. Have a great week. Bye.